That brutal blast of bitter Arctic air leaving more than 200 million Americans under alert for dangerous wind chills, snow, and ice. Really bad, yeah, do not drive at all. It's not worth it. Snow blanketing the roads in northern New Jersey. ABC's Trevor Alt in Morristown with the road crews. And the road crews are already at work pretty early today. We got all the salt here, and you can actually see the crews as they're in motion. They're loading up the salt trucks. New York City breaking a snow drought, the first single day inch of snow in nearly two years. The snow and ice making travel treacherous in the south. In Alabama, this truck swerving, and this one shutting down I-10 after overturning near Houston, Texas. In the Midwest, wind chills dropping as low as 45 degrees below zero. ABC's Alex Perez in a frozen Chicago with tips for drivers headed into the bitter cold. Now, if you're having trouble with your battery, which is pretty common when it gets this cold, J.D. Power recommends flickering your high beams for about 15 to 30 seconds. They say that process actually helps to wake up and recharge your battery. Out west, avalanche warnings in effect for the Rockies and parts of Utah. Authorities in Wyoming say a skier died in an avalanche. It's the third avalanche death just this month in the U.S. And there's another storm system behind this one, and it's taking aim at the Pacific Northwest. It moves in later today, bringing rain from Seattle to San Francisco and then snow to the Cascades. I'm Morgan Norwood, ABC News, New York.